Greeting Commanders, here is the agenda which I would like to show you in this video. I just finished another expedition and I would like to share my feedback on the ship. Phantom may be considered as one of the best exploration ship in game. It have enough space to install all necessary models, including Super Cruise Assistant to prevent accidents. It have excellent view from the cabin, good temper temperature management system and very decent jump range. The excite of this ship is uh, size of this ship. And not only size, but configuration of the landing gear. Even on pretty smooth surface like this, I was mm, constantly facing issues to find a landing spot. I don't even speak about mountains. However, as I said, this is a great exploration vessel, and for those who don't really focus on the biological samples collection, that might be a very great ship candidate. This expedition was the longest in my experience so far. 6000 light years in one direction. As a result, I become a pioneer of the few worlds. I was first man on many planets. I saw much stunning surface views. I also reported many yet unknown biological samples to the Vesta Genomics and received some reward for that. More details uh, on this expedition you will find at the end of this video in appendix. And uh, as a reward for my next run in exobiology, I got beautiful blue helmet for my Artemis suit. Preparing myself for the next expedition, I decided to upgrade core ship components, life support and sensors. They generate great unnecessary weight for the exploration vessel and uh, not really vital components during expedition. To start work with this engineer, I had to gain ally status with Alliance and its main faction. The system where he works is a capital of the Alliance and permit is required. One tip I would like to share is to ensure that you do missions at the systems which not far from the Elliot for more than 15 years. After getting access, Bill requested 50 units of bromelite, and uh, as I learned, this is a very rare commodity, and uh, it's available only on carriers with insane price, so I had to mine this by myself. Let me instantly jump to the new models. In my case, mining multi-limpet controller. This able to do prospector and collector functions at the same time. It occupy only third grade internal slot, have four active limpets, um, action distance is 5 km and limpet lifetime is unlimited. Usual collector model of the fifth grade size have much shorter action distance, uh, limpet lifetime only seven, 720 seconds and only three active limpets are allowed. So this is a great improvement for the miners. However, I found the back side of this new model. If you engaged four prospector limpets already, you can't issue new con collector limpets. And in opposite way, if you have four active collector limpets, you can't issue new prospector. 
The only way how to solve this is to switch off model, which will drop all active limpets, unfortunately. Maybe this is a controller software issue bug and the engineers will fix it soon, I don't know. But for my purpose, I just use this model as pure collector controller and with the two mining lasers and uh, 10 active collectors, my mining session was pretty short. I consumed 100 limpets and at the end I gathered 94 units of bromelite, some tritium and few other commodities which was just garbage. For those who has a passion and uh, yet here, I prepared a short video about my expedition, so thank you for watching and have a nice day.